Hello, and welcome to the Advise Training video series. This video will demonstrate how to use the specific interface within Advise. Advise supports a feature in conjunction with EMC software, where in a master-slave configuration, Advise can be controlled as the slave to that other EMC software. This is very similar to the generic interface, but it's important to note now that the specific interface can do everything the generic interface can do, and more. Users would use this specific interface when they want to visually monitor equipment under test and pass those results back to the EMC software of choice with actual ROI values, not just go, no go values. This is the differentiator between the specific interface and the generic interface, as well as the fact that this specific interface is only available with EMC32 and Electra from Rune Schwartz. To use the specific interface, users would launch EMC32 or Electra alongside Advise. And in Advise, they will run a test in remote mode. After selecting a test, you can arrange EMS values on the screen at any location you would like. These EMS values are passed from the EMC software. Once ready to go, start the test. Now Advise is waiting for EMC32 or Electra and is officially in slave mode. As the test is running, if an ROI event occurs during a measurement period, Advise will pass the ROI value back, whether that's a 0 or a 1, or an actual ROI value. As an example, when using a pixel intensity ROI, Advise passes the actual intensity value. As you can see in this example, however, each ROI has its own dedicated channel where you can look for events that occurred. Once you reach the end of a test, you can look at a table which presents all of the frequencies at which an event occurred. One more important note to make here is that even though Advise is under remote control, it is still recording all pertinent information which is accessible after a test is completed. For more information and to download product literature such as the product brochure and datasheet, please visit the link shown at the end of this video. Thank you for watching.